So many of you in the past have said that you liked the two-word prayer that I've given you. I've actually given it to you several times. Two words, divine order. When things are in chaos, when things are in a very confusing maze in front of you and you don't know which way to go, what to do, or how in the world things will ever work out, you say the prayer, divine order. Why well, decree today in Jesus Christ's name that this week your life is in divine order, that God's perfect order is always present in your life every day this week. And you see evidence of this order as you study the arrangements of everything around you. As you look into the sky and you see the, the planets and the stars. As you learn about nature and the scientific laws that ensure a balance of life here on earth. Well, even so, as we do this, as we gaze at all the beauty that God has created... If our life is in chaos, we have that chaos internally. And it is difficult to see the order that is present in our own lives. Especially when those times, those times are taking place where everything is out of order and beyond or seemingly beyond our ability to control. But I tell you, we can regain our power. We can regain our sense of order when we connect with God and when we allow God to come through us to work out our situations, to straighten the maze. We regain a sense of order and peace as we adjust the way that we view our world. When God comes through you, you will see your world, the situations in your life, in a new and a higher way. Rather than focusing on chaos and appearances of disorder, you focus instead on God and God's order and God's love for all humanity. With your thoughts focused on God, you begin to realize with a deep realization that order does exist even when you can't see the order. God brings into manifestation all that is right and all that is good. Do you remember in 1 Corinthians 7 verse 35 where it says, I say this, to promote good order and to secure your individual, undivided devotion to the Lord. Well, I pray that you have undivided devotion to God. There are two ways to look in life. You can look on chaos and problems, or you can look to God. I pray that you look to God, because as you do, You'll be in filled with power. As you do, you'll be in filled with peace. And as you do, you'll have a sense of divine order literally in filling your mind and your body and your life. God bless your week with perfect order.